the Great Voltager is next in. This is a St. Ledger trial, of course, and it's for three year olds. Colts, and the top one is the Greg Gatsby for Dan Hughes, Cyclone Jethro for Darren Thompson, DJ Dan for David Hooley, Dan's Watches for Steve Ran, Fight Without Fear, Leon Van Rensburg, Loppy Not Cheetah, David Robertson, and Sea of Tranquility, Paul Rhodes. So, seven of them then this time. And all quietly installed and ready to go. And away they go with greys wide again, or a grey on the fence and a grey drawn wide. The same as in the last race, and who's going to be the first one to show? It looks like it's going to be a sea of tranquility for Paul Rhodes that's going to try and get the lead, but on its inside, and I'm going to get the rail is Loppy Not Cheetah. So Loppy Not Cheetah, Cyclone Jethro, and Sea of Tranquility were virtually in the line, but now Sea of Tranquility has got that lead to itself and has gone on by a couple of lengths to Cyclone Jethro in second, and then Loppy Not Cheetah in third. The grey, the grey Gatsby, is one on the track in fourth, and just tucked in behind that one is DJ Dan, and then Fight Without Fear with the second of the greys, Dan's Watches, just the back marker. So Sea of Tranquility is in the lead. About two to three lengths with Cyclone Jethro in second. The Greg Gatsby on the outside is third. And Loppin' Up Cheetah on the rail fourth. DJ down and fight without fear next. And then just a little bit detached at the back. Dan's watches the second of the greys. Sea of Tranquility. It's got an undisputed lead, and the chasing pack seem quite happy to let that one lead by about three lengths. With Loppy Not Cheetah uh, moving into a clear second, Cyclone Jethro is third, and also getting a bit closer on the inside. Fight without fear. Dan's watches is making a little bit of move a move as well on past DJ Dan. But it's Sea of Tranquility is still in front. Oh, Dan's all over the place here, aren't we? It's Sea of Tranquility in the lead. Then now about to be joined by Loppy Not Cheetah and Cyclone Jethro. Bit of a gap back to fight without fear. Then comes Dan's watches in the Greg Gatsby. And then DJ Dan's a back marker. But it's still Sea of Tranquility in the lead. The one that's making the best looking progress at the moment appears to be Dan's watches. But it's Sea of Tranquility who's about a length and a half, two lengths up from Loppy Not Cheetah in second. Cyclone Jethro is third. Then fight without fear. Dan's watches on the outside. He's next. It's Surely between these, and as they race down towards the final two furlongs in the Great Voltager, and Sea of Tranquility is now five clear, and they don't seem to be catching him at the moment. Sea of Tranquility, Jock has to look round, locking up Cheetah in second, then fight without fear, Cyclone Jethro, and Dan's watches, but it's still Sea of Tranquility. Sea of Tranquility past the furlong pole is in the lead by four of the field, and now beginning to close the leaders tying up. Here comes fight without fear, locking up Cheetah, Dan's watches, and the great ground the outside, and coming up towards the line now, it's going to be mighty close. It's fight without fear, and locking up Cheetah in a Photo with Sea of Tranquility run out of steam and ended up third. But it's a photo finish. I'm not sure which one of those two got up to take it. It's very close. It says Fight Without Fear there, but I wouldn't be surprised if that's a dead heat. And it is a dead heat. Fight Without Fear for Leon Van Rensburg and Loppin' Up Cheetah for David Robertson will share the spoils. And Sea of Tranquility, the long-time leader for Paul Rhodes, was f was third. Dan's watch is fourth for Steve Rand. That one looks like it might just stay the ledger trip. That one it was definitely running on. So too was the great Gatsby that was fifth for Dan Hughes.